What's going on everybody? In today's video, we are going to be talking about the three must-have tools for your real estate investment business. Now, these are all three tools that I use every single day in my real estate investment business and that were actually given to me by other full-time successful real estate investors. And the best part about these tools is that they are all free. So I'm going to have a link to all three of them at the bottom of this video. So definitely go check these out uh, once the video is over. All right, well, let's get into it. Okay, so tool number one is going to be the deal analyzer. So this is a must have for any real estate investor. I mean, this is probably the first thing that you need as a real estate investor. And you know, I'll tell you a quick story. When I first got started, I didn't have a deal analyzer. And I actually worked with a more experienced investor and he didn't have a deal analyzer. And he, so, somehow we were still able to buy and sell properties. But I can tell you, if we had had one of these, uh, you know, five, 10 years ago, uh, we would have made a lot less mistakes and we would have been a lot more accurate with our estimates. Because when you first get started, you pretty much think every house is a deal. And while every house technically could be a deal, um, by, by having a deal analyzer, it's going to run very conservative numbers also known as very accurate numbers and it's going to give you you know your projected profit after taking out you know commissions closing costs holding costs financing costs things like that so you're definitely going to want to use this uh, probably every day anytime you're looking at a deal I would run it through the deal analyzer all right so tool number two is the repair estimator so this is going to be an itemized uh, basically Excel worksheet which is going to have all the you know an, an estimate of all the numbers uh, for repairs that a house might need and the great thing about it is that uh, well number one it's customizable so each area is going to have different repair costs depending on where you live um, so the best way to fill it in is kind of you know you can ask around you can look at case studies you can even go on there's a website I think it's called homeadvisor.com where you plug in your zip code and then you plug in the repair costs or, or the actual repair that you're looking to do like let's say replace a roof and so you type in your zip code and and you want to say I want to replace a roof and it'll give you a low estimate a medium estimate and then a high estimate so if you're unsure about what repairs cost in your area you I would highly recommend you check out that site then you can plug it into your repair estimator and then it's it's uh, it's a great tool because it, it actually has a buffer so there's about a 10% buffer in it so whatever your repair costs are it then adds 10% to it so that kind of gives you a more accurate number because a lot of times especially when you're starting out your repair costs, your repair costs are very rarely going to be less than you anticipated. Almost always it's going to be more. And 10% usually uh, gets you right there in the ballpark. And if you want to, you can also ask uh, other real estate investors, other real estate agents, ask different contractors, uh, you know, what different things cost to repair. Because, you know, you're, you'll probably get different numbers from different people. Actually, I'm certain you, you'll probably get different numbers from different people. So you want to kind of get a range on, uh, you know, what people think and what people estimate different uh, repairs are going to be. Okay, so tool number three. This is great if you're like a big direct mail nerd like I am. So I love direct mail. I think everyone should do direct mail. And the great thing about this resource is that it manages all your direct mail campaigns for you. So if you have multiple campaigns going, and if you're sending out direct mail, there's no reason why you shouldn't have multiple campaigns going. You should have at least a minimum of like a three touch campaign. So this will keep track of all your mailings. Because when you start to mail out multiple campaigns and you're on like your fourth or even fifth campaign and you have like three or four different lists and you're mailing let's say 45 days apart, it can just be like such a headache to manage all that. And this, this app is uh, very simple and, and just a very easy tool to use and I would highly recommend it uh, if you're doing direct mail. So that's going to be at the bottom of this video. Okay, so there you have it, the three must-have tools for real estate investors. You have the uh, deal analyzer, repair estimator, and direct mail tracker. So all three are going to be at the bottom of this video in links. Uh, definitely go download them, check them out. Let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will catch you on the next one. All right, bye.